Hey beauties and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys a brand new subscription service called Deck of Scarlet. And I used this palette to create this look today, but first I wanted to kind of give you guys some details about Deck of Scarlet. Deck of Scarlet is a brand new subscription service and you pay $29.95 every other month and you receive this really beautiful palette. You get a lot of different options. It comes with three eyeshadows, two cheek colors, two lip colors, and two pencils, an eye pencil and also a lip pencil. When you subscribe to Deck of Scarlet, it is of course free shipping. You can cancel anytime if you don't like the palette or skip the palette. That's also an option which I think is really cool because sometimes you don't really like things, but with this, if you don't like it, you could totally skip out on the palette. Every palette is 100% cruelty free, paraben free, and made in the USA. So another thing I wanted to mention that is actually really awesome is that every other month, they will collaborate with a YouTuber to create a palette. So the first edition of the Deck of Scarlet palette was with the YouTuber Kelly Strack. And I don't own that particular palette, but if you guys were interested in it, you can still purchase it. This is the second edition of the Deck of Scarlet palette. This is the January to February release in collaboration with Sandra Deluxe. Sandra's amazing. She has an amazing channel. She's so beautiful, gorgeous, fabulous, and her talent is out of this world. She's amazing at makeup and I definitely look up to her and I've been watching her for a while. So when I saw that she was collaborating with Deck of Scarlet, I had to have this palette and try it for myself because she's one of my favorite YouTubers. So if you guys wanna share this video and let Sandra know that I created this look, that would totally make my day, just saying. I think what's really awesome about this is that I'll get to see so many different combinations from different YouTubers that will collaborate with Deck of Scarlet. So you will have a palette from your favorite YouTuber and you will actually get to see your favorite YouTuber do a tutorial using their own palette, which I think is really special. And for someone like me that watches a lot of YouTube and for you guys, I think that makes it really fun. It makes me want to subscribe to Deck of Scarlet. So I just wanted to put that out there. I just wanted to add in a few additional thoughts on the Deck of Scarlet palette. I definitely think for $29.95 every other month, this is totally worth it. You can create so many different looks from day to night looks to soft to very glam looks and you have a lot of options and you have everything you need. There's really no way for you to mess up. If you're kind of a newcomer when it comes to makeup and you need a little bit of guidance, this type of palette is so amazing for that because you have every shade you need. And it's just great because it's not overwhelming when it comes to makeup. You have everything you need in here you don't have to go out and purchase a bunch of different things all the time. You really can just get this and be set. And I think that's great because all the essentials are in this palette and you really don't need much more. You could use any of these shades all over your face. So you guys will see in this video, I actually used a lot of different things around the face. I used the lip color for my liner. You can totally play around and have fun and makeup is all about being creative and trying new things. And that's what I love about this palette is you could actually really allow yourself to be creative. It's kind of limitless if that makes sense. And I also think it's great for someone like me that is kind of obsessed with makeup, that loves to try new things. So if you're like me and you just love makeup and you're obsessed because let's be real here, if you're watching this video, come on. If you're like me and you are just a makeup addict, this is amazing too because it allows you to try something new and I'm all about that. So I quickly wanted to show you guys how I received it in the mail. This is the box, super really nice. This is freaking sleek, okay? This is nice. It says you're in as the liner and it has the deck of Scarlet and it also has this, has Sandra's beautiful face on it. Created this look right here, definitely like a soft look with a little bit of drama. If you guys would like to see that, then keep watching. And if you like this video, be sure to let me know by thumbsing this video up, like it, subscribe, share. So if you guys would like to know how to get my Deck of Scarlet look using the January to February edition collaboration with Miss Sandra Deluxe, then please continue on watching. All right, so I have my face makeup done and my brows already done. I have one eye done, so I look super amazing. Damn it. So we're gonna go ahead and finish off this eye. I'm gonna go in with the shade Montego Bay and Montego Bay is actually the bronzing shade in the palette. This is what it looks like. It's very beautiful. It's definitely not a matte. It has shimmer in it, but it's perfect for a transition. So I'm gonna go right into the crease with that shade. Thing that I really like about this palette is there's really no limits. You could use any of these products for anything. So just because this is a bronzer, doesn't mean you can't use it for an eyeshadow. And that goes for the lip product too. I actually used that for my liner today. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that later. So next I'm gonna take this reddish kind of rosy shade called Maya and I'm gonna pop this onto the lid. So I'm just gonna go in and start packing this onto the lid. 
So I wanted to create a wing, so I'm gonna go in with actually the lip color, and this is in Woo. It's a really pretty, dark, deep red, and it's very creamy, so I'm actually gonna set it with this shade in the middle. And just to go in and set that out, I'm gonna go in with the matte red and go right over the wing just to set it because it is a lip color and it is a creamy lip color. It's not gonna be like a liquid lipstick, so you definitely need to set this with the shadow. Now to deepen everything up, I'm gonna go in with the shade Black Roses and Black Roses is the black in the palette, it's so pretty. So I just recommend going in with the small brush first and just lightly kind of packing this into the bend that your wing has, so right into the center of it and just bring it up. And this is really good for people that have a little bit of like a hooded eye going on. This will really define your eyes and give you a crease. So if you don't have a crease, this is a really good trick. Now I'm gonna go back into the matte red and lightly dust this onto the top of the crease area. Now I'm gonna go in and highlight the brow bone as well as the inner corner of my eye. And I'm kind of gonna go over the lid as well with the shade Shimmy Shimmy Ya. Yeah, and Shimmy Shimmy Ya yeah is the highlight. Also gonna bring this on the brow bone and lightly kind of go over the dark red to blend everything. Also gonna take a little bit more of that shade, Shimmy Shimmy Ya, yeah, and apply this just right over that red shade we used called Maya. And now I'm going back in with Maya and I'm just gonna go right over that, give it a little bit of shimmer, and I'm connecting the shade to the wing. So now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna line the waterline using the liner Anarchy which is a long wear eyeliner, and this is a really nice black. And because I wanted more of like a red waterline instead of black, I'm gonna go over that with the Velvet Lip Liner in Heartless. And this is like a burgundy brownish red. So now I'm just adding some mascara, and then we can actually just pop on some lashes and move on to the face. And before I pop on some lashes, I'm gonna go back in with Montego Bay right over everything, just to kind of warm it up a little bit this is like a really pretty bronzer. It looks so good in the crease and like on the eyes. All right, so moving on to the face, I'm gonna use Montego Bay as a bronzer. And for those of you who kind of have my complexion, I'm a little bit more fair to light. I think that this would look really nice on you because it's not overwhelming. It's very pretty because it does have shimmer in it, but it just looks so glowy on the skin and it gives a lot of warmth. So I'm just gonna dip into it and apply it to the cheeks. And it's just so pretty because it's just, not too much. It's just really nice for day-to-day -day wear. I think this is my favorite thing in the palette. I just love the color of it. I've seen this bronzer on a lot of different skin tones and it looks so beautiful on everyone. Also gonna apply it to the forehead just to warm everything up. And with these types of bronzers, you could really use them all over your face, on your neck. Because they're shimmer, they're not gonna be as harsh as a matte would be. So it can kind of be used all around the face to warm everything up. So now I'm gonna go into the highlight and I'm gonna use Shimmy Shimmy Yeah. And Shimmy Shimmy Yeah is the beautiful shade we used on the inner corner. I'm actually gonna use it on my cheekbones and also my nose. I'm just going to apply this on the cheeks. Ooh, it's very pretty. I was watching Sandra's video of her day to night look. If you guys haven't seen it, you have to check it out because she did such a beautiful look using her palette. And she said this was more of like a candlelight type of glow. This isn't gonna be like a highlighter that's like beaming and super obvious. It's just a really beautiful like day-to-day -day type of highlight. Just gives like the most soft, beautiful glow. So for lips, I'm gonna go in with the Heartless Velvet Lip Liner and I'm just going to line first. And I think I wanna do an ombre lip, so I'm just gonna kind of line the outer corners as well and just lightly fill them in. And now I'm gonna take the lipstick in Scrumptious and this is so creamy. So now I'm gonna take the shade Woo, which is the reddish color, darker red, and I'm going to apply this in the outer corners of my mouth. All right, beauty, so this is the final look that I created using the Sandra Deluxe Deck of Scarlet palette. I love this palette that she created. I love the colors that she picked. I feel like they're just so wearable for every day. And I overall really love the Deck of Scarlet in itself. I think you can get so many different looks out of this palette and overall, I really loved it and I hope you guys did too. If you have any more questions about Deck of Scarlet, please reference my description box. I'm gonna have all of the information on Deck of Scarlet listed down below. So if you do have any questions, be sure to check there or leave me a comment and I will reply back. I hope you guys enjoyed this look and if you did, don't forget to like it, subscribe and share. Don't forget to hit the bell button so you guys don't miss any of my upcoming videos and thank you all so much for watching today i will see you all in my next tutorial